tiger. Hi, tigers. Isn't that fun? Dr. Lecture's in my office. Right now. This is awesome. We're having a little bit of technical difficulties. So that is why we are here together. And it is Friday, January 5th, 2024. And we are going to share the KTA news with you. Dr. Letcher, can you start us off to pump up sports for third quarter, please? I would love it. First of all, shout out to all of our sports that just ended in December. We had boys basketball, we had cheer, we had wrestling. We had so many great sports and we wanna keep up that great Tiger pride and Tiger momentum. So we would love to have our girls basketball team. We just finished a great season of boys basketball. Would love to have girls basketball. So girls, please, please, please try out. We would love to have a team. Talk to Mr. Gwynn. Try out start this week uh, coming up Monday. And uh, many girls were on the team last year. We would love to have you come back and join again. So let's just get a lot of great um, interest in that. Boys soccer is another team that uh, is at Apprende, as you know, but we have great success with that. As Mr. Collins will tell you that we have great student athletes here at KTA that are participating with Apprende and those tryouts start Monday. So registration happens now. You need to go online, you need to register, you need to get your uh, sports physical, all those important things. Mr. Gwynn and Miss Stacy can help you if you have any specific questions, but get that going, please. Boys, soccer, girls, basketball, go Tigers. So on that note, I'm going to share a video that our very own Miss Watabi shared with us and created highlighting our boys basketball team and their success. This is them at the very end in their final game. So thank you, Miss Watabi, for creating this, and I hope you all enjoy. <laughs> Tommy, that was fantastic. And I just want to say again, I was so proud of our team. Such great sportsmanship. You guys never gave up and you just kept plugging till the very, very end. I couldn't have been prouder. And at the end too, after the game, all the team members and your families were taking pictures outside. And I know it's hard. It's super hard to lose and you invested so much into it, but you showed such great sportsmanship. I could not have been prouder of the entire team. Yes. Wonderful job. Another cool event happening soon that Miss Scott wanted to make sure we shared is a Kyrene Winter Guard. There's an interest meeting coming up on Monday, January 8th from 6 to 6.45 p.m. at Apprende. All 6th or 8th graders are welcome. I'm going to show you a video of the Corona del Sol Guard and what they do just so you can have an idea of what we're talking about. The same coaches for the Corona Guard will be leading this Kyrene Winter Guard. if you didn't already have one just of what a guard is and what they might do if you're at all interested in dance or music. 
um, any type of performance, this might be something you're interested in trying out. At the very least, you can go to the parent info meeting and ask questions you might have. You can also reach out to Ms. Scott. She has a lot of knowledge in this area and would be able to help any of you who might be interested. And it's boys and girls, right? It is. Yeah, boys and, and girls. Yes, yeah, fantastic. Any sixth or eighth graders. Super fun. Oh my gosh, talking about super fun next week, friends, we have a big, big thing going on next week, Thursday and Friday, January 11th and 12th. We are having a uh, group of judges here to uh, visit us, to visit every single classroom, every single program, all areas of our school. There will be three or four judges from the Arizona Educational Foundation, and they are looking to see how we're doing. And they wanna know, is KTA still an A-plus school? We know that we are. We hope that they will see that too. But they just want to see what kind of a school we have. And are we continuing the wonderful things that we have had in place for many years? Our last A plus was in 2019. So that's several years ago. And many of you probably don't even remember that process. It was such a long time ago. But this is so important that we put on our very, very best effort. And we do our very best in classes that day on the playground. And I know you do that every day, but it's like when you have company come and visit, you want it just to put in that little extra effort to show what a great place this is to learn, uh, what great friends, what great teachers, what great community families we have. So when you see those judges on Thursday, Friday, they also may invite you to be part of a uh, student meeting. So there'll be a student meeting on Friday morning. They may give you a ticket and invite you to that meeting on Friday morning. So if they do take that, that's like a golden ticket and you will be one of about 20 or 25 students going to that meeting to share your ideas and your input about what KTA is all about. So looking forward to it, keep that in mind, Thursday, Friday, make sure you, on Thursday you are in full school uniform at the uniform day. Friday is a spirit day. So both of those things are important, a regular uniform day, Thursday, spirit day on Friday. Thank you, Dr. Lesher. And I just want to remind everyone, a week from Monday, we do not have school. We're, we are honoring Martin Luther King on that day. So just like we've talked about the rest of this week, keep that in mind as you're planning. That is it for our announcements today. Thanks for coming in here and joining oh, me, Dr. Lesher. Again. This is super fun. Exactly. We hope you all have a wonderful Friday and a safe and amazing weekend. Go, Go Tigers! Tigers.